The prize, mother truckers. Uh, hey guys, what's up? This is Platinum Fitness, Gulf Coast. We are coming at you guys with a little core cardio workout for you guys, okay? So if you are at home and you wanna start getting a little jog in place as you go through this dynamic warm up, uh, get those chicken wings going as well. That would just be fantastic, okay? Courtney is gonna be demonstrating for us today. So we have six exercises in total today. So not uh, gonna have to keep track of a ton of movements. Just gotta focus on those for six, we'll get through them about six rounds, hitting each one almost like a hurricane style format. Uh, once we complete all six rounds, we got stuff at the beginning, we got a lot in the middle, and we got some at the end for y'all, okay? So let's change that jog into some high knees, get that heart rate up. First exercise we're gonna court is a thread the needle. You will be on a side plank or an oblique pillar as we call them in Tennessee, and then you're gonna reach through. So you're gonna bring that arm up, get the stretch, reach all the way around, really rotating those shoulders, uh, get that big twist on the oblique. Guys, if you need to modify this, you can break that down to a knee, do the exact same movement, okay? Exercise number two is gonna be a reverse burpee. So you'll be on your booty, you will roll up, then you will jump at the top, sit back down nice and slow, just like so. Okay, guys, if that's a little bit difficult for you, that's fine. You're just going to do regular burpees, okay? Drop down all the way to the floor, pop all the way up to the top. Exercise number three, let's get 20 toe touches, 20 hip rotations, please. We have a tabletop crunch, so here's the deal, all right? You are going to be holding this crunch position. Now, Courtney is driving her hands through her thighs. Here's the deal, you'll see me periodically throughout the workout come over and try to separate those hands and those knees, okay? That is not gonna happen. That's how hard we want you guys holding that crunch. Exercise number four is a cross body mountain climber with a pause. So every time that knee gets to the opposite level, we're gonna hold that twist for a second, okay? Then back to the other side. Notice the transition of the legs is quick, but every time that knee gets up to the elbow, she holds that contraction, okay? If you need to do regular mountain climbers there, same exact thing, more than okay, all right? Let's get some lunges with some core rotations, all right? Exercise number five is a windshield flutter. So think about combining uh, windshield wipers where we go left to the middle and then to the right, but doing it with a flutter. So we'll go all the way to one side, we'll come up, we'll go right down to the middle, and then we'll bring it back up and go down to the other side like so, okay? Trying to keep those legs straight as possible. Last exercise today. Let's get some side bends going at home. 20 side bends to each side, one of those obliques. We have a corkscrew. So you will be laying on the ground. Your palms will be facing down, okay? You can put your palms under your back to the side, over your chest, up to you. But you are going to pick your feet up and then twist your hip to the side, okay? So as you drive those heels towards the ceiling, you're gonna twist uh, right at that hip region, okay? And if the twist is too much, that's fine. We're just gonna do regular hip lifts, uh, like so, or leg raises, up to you either way, all right? So. All right, we're gonna spread out, we're gonna get to it, okay? So, find some space. But first, we got a little starter for y'all today, okay? So we're gonna start off by going 25 seconds on, 10 seconds off, you have four sets in total. We're gonna switch back and forth between a high knee sprint and a speed jack, all right? So, the mastermind is gonna get that clock up and running. We're gonna dive right on in to these high knees. And there it is, 25 on, 10 off, non-stop, full speed, starting in five seconds, man. You want to start getting that little pop step in place as Courtney likes to get her fighting style going. Three, two, one, high knees as fast as you can, pumping those arms, dear God, please. Make sure y'all going full speed today, okay? Guys, what this is supposed to do is we're gonna engage that core right off the beginning. We're gonna start this workout off with a nice little calorie burn. We're gonna elevate that heart rate, and then once you get into those core movements, we're gonna slow it down a little bit so you can focus on those abdominal contractions. Three, two, and one, all right? So next set, we're going right into a speed jack, all right? If you need to step out that speed jack instead, that's also okay. Just go hella fast. On your mark, get set, let's go, let's go. So get to jacking all the way through these 25 <laughs> seconds here as fast as you can, as quickly as possible. Burn those cows today, guys. Y'all got 10 seconds left in that set. Good, good job to push through. Good job fighting through it, man. Look, not everything's always gonna go your way, but you gotta persevere anyway. Three, two, and one. Find a way to recover. 
Um, and then let's get back into those high knees. Okay, one more set of high knees, one more set of speed jacks. Three, two, one, let's go. Fast as you can, high knees. Fast as you can, high knees. You got one more set of these, one more set of speed jacks. Don't pick and choose which set you decide to be great on. Either be great or don't be great. 15 seconds left, good. Guys, notice those knees are coming even with their hips every single time. They're using those arms, why? Because the faster you move your arms, the faster you move your feet. You're down to your last three, two, and one. Great job, y'all. We got one, one last set of speed jacks. And we're gonna dive on into your workout, okay? On your mark, get set. Bang, we're starting on the extra reps here. Come on, good. But least not be died, mother truckers. Get you some speed jacks. Not slow jacks, not low jacks, speed jacks. 15 seconds of them left here. Good, feet go out, feet go in. Hands go up, hands go down. As fast as you can possibly muster up in a 25 second interval. You're down to your last five, your last three, your last rep. Good job. So everybody, find some space, whether you're doing this at home, uh, if you're doing this in the bathroom, on the roof of your house, in somebody's pool, whatever. We're starting off with thread the needle. So remember, we're trying to keep those hips up nice and high. We're engaging that bottom side of your obliques. Okay, we're gonna get that nice big stretch through the top, open up that core, and then dip that shoulder, really get that twist in as we reach around towards your side. Okay guys, do not forget, you can perform this movement from your knees. You're probably not gonna be able to get as much of a rotation, but we can still get that pull in and that pull out. Three, two, one, great job. Relax, 10 seconds, all right? Going down to the next one. This is a reverse burpee. You're, you're, you're on your boat, or you can start standing up if you want to, all right? Ready? Get set, let's go, good. Roll those feet forward, okay? You gotta use your hands to get up. Use your hands to get up. You, okay, okay, Lily. Okay, if you wanna use one leg to get up, that works too. Whatever floats your boat to be great today. Come on down if being a beast is what you're about. You're down to your last three, two, and one. Good, we got a tabletop crunch, so we're on our back, all right? Knees are up in our chest. Here's the deal. Don't let your legs dominate this movement. We want your shoulder blades peeled all the way off the ground as you drive through those hands. Three, two, and one, 25 seconds. Now, here's the deal. If you lose that connection between your legs and your hands, you will run a mile at the end of the set. You have 10 seconds remaining here. Find a way to lock that out, okay? All those abs engaged for 25 seconds. Three, two, one, relax. Great, great job. We have a crossbody mountain climber with a pause, okay? So be in that high plank position. Shoot that leg over. Three, two, one. Let's put in some solid sweat equity here. Let's go, good. Guys, notice the transition of the knees. It's quick, it's violent, it's swift and it's lethal for any type of belly fat if you're doing it the right way. 10 seconds remaining on that set here, guys. You're down to your final. Five seconds, hold the pause. Hold that pause, hold that knee by that elbow, and three, two, one, relax. Good job, guys. We're gonna roll right into those windshield flutters. So remember, we're gonna start with your feet right down the middle. You're gonna flutter up, move down to the left, down to the right, back to the middle. Three, two, one, let's go. Let's go, good, awesome. The key to this, guys, is you wanna keep your shoulders flat on the ground, so let's try putting those hands out to the side. Don't let your palms come off the ground, okay? Force your core to be the motion that gets those feet over, okay? You got about five seconds left. Good, nice rotation down to one side, down to the middle, down to the other, and three, two, one, relax. Great work, okay? Corkscrews, all we have left, okay? Again, either hands out to the side, behind your back, across your chest, push your feet up, get the twist at the top, three, two, one, let's go. Good, turn those hips at the top, okay? If you need to support your head here as well, that's okay. A great way, actually, to engage those top two bagel bites that make up uh, that six pack of awesomeness, okay? You're down to your final five. Three, two, one, you're done. Good job, you got about a 22 and a half second, well really 26 and a half second rest break, okay? So pop off, get yourself a sip of water, refresh, rehydrate, get ready to boom on this next round here. 20 seconds, and we start the next one. Let's go, let's go, good. 
We're going to start off with those thread the needles, okay? So whatever side you started on last time, flip on over to that other side. Engage that oppo oblique in five seconds. In three seconds. And there are no seconds remaining on rest. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's grind. Let's grind. All about it today. Come on. Come on. Good. Wherever you are watching this, okay? If you're in Florida, the beaches, man, they open. Hopefully, you're not the one sitting on the beach with a shirt on. Work hard to expose those abs today. Work hard. I want every one of y'all sitting with that bottle of extra virgin olive oil ready to lather those bad boys up. Three, two, one. Rest break time. Good work. Reverse burpee, guys. Start on your booty. Roll those knees forward. Get the jump at the top. Let's go. Get lean. Get mean, baby. Three, two, one. Go work. Go work. Awesome job, okay? If you want to be an extra try hard today and go off on one leg, that's also encouraged, guys. Something to work towards, okay? Right? Give it a shot with one leg. If you can't do it, then we got some goals to set and some goals to crush, all right? You're down to your last seven seconds. Remaining here. Good. Roll through. Nice. Power up to the top. Three, two, one. Tabletop crunch, okay? Not to be confused with the tabletop where Cam stands behind Tim and I shoved him in the chest, okay? You're going to hold the crunch. Hands out. Hands and knees. Ready, set, go. Come on down. Come on down. Remember, guys, it's okay if your feet, your knees, and your hands become separated, all right? A mile's not that long. It's just 5,280 freaking feet. You're gonna hold me, Cam. You got five seconds left here. Go ahead, fight through it. Fight through it, drive those hands. You should be a little shaky, shaky. In three, two, one. Great work, great work. When, actually no, not windshield flutters. We got some crossbody mountain climbers, good. Good. Guys, again, if you have shoulder issues at home, okay, you need to still do ab intensive stuff. Three, two, one. We can rock out that bike. Same thing. Every time that elbow crosses, we hold the crunch. We rotate over the other side. Nice, quick transition with the legs. Nice, long squeeze. One to three seconds with the knee to the elbow. You got about 10 seconds to go. Good. Don't be afraid to slow that movement down. You're down to your last five. Push through your last three. Get that last rep in and relax. Good work. Now, we got the windshield flutters. Side to side. And down the middle. <laughs> Sounded just like it. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Windshield wipers, guys. Side to side. And remember, those hands cannot leave the ground. Notice every time they rotate those legs, they're driving those palms down. Why? Because you don't want our shoulders to overtake this movement, start getting our chest, our upper body involved. We just want that core powering through these reps today. Rotate to one side, down to the middle, hit the other side. Three, two, one, sets over. Oh, we got some corkscrews, baby. Corkscrews, open it up, push those hips through the roof, drive your heels into the ceiling. Three, two, one, get better, get better. Come on, come on, 25 seconds. Don't give up at home when it starts to burn, when it starts to get uncomfortable. That's when you really got to focus on finishing that set. Find out how good it feels to get uncomfortable and keep freaking going. You're down to your last seven. Twist those hips. If not, guys, just do the hip lift. Don't worry about the twist. Get the hips off the ground. And three, and one, and done. Good job. Relax. All right. A little rest break. If you need it, hop off. If not, stay there. Chill. Okay? And we'll be back in 20 minutes seconds, okay? Good, guys. Great time. If you want to do use these uh, periods in between to get some active rest, you can always knock out some slow bicycles in place until we get right into that thread the needle in about five seconds. Remember, we're back to that original elbow. Three, two, one. Let's go. Open it up. Close the door. Open it back up. We get that nice big stretch to the top. You reach all the way through, working on that little side accordion here, okay? So notice, there's our stretch, there's our twist. Notice that shoulder rotating down towards the ground. All that tension going on to the oblique, and then we stretch that core right back out with your final five seconds of work. Your last three, last two, and last rep. That's an excellent, excellent job, okay? We're gonna go right into those reverse burpees. Right into those reverse burpees. So let's roll onto our back. And five, three, one, bangers, man. Oh, bangers, man. 25 seconds of it here. Let's go. I love it. Excellent effort today, guys. Look, if you start to fatigue and you need to modify, don't. 
find a way to push. No, if you start to fatigue, you need to modify. Guys, go to those regular burpees. That's okay, but stay in movement. Stay in motion. Find a way to get it done. Always, always, always stay in motion. Three, two, and one. Tabletop crunch. Let's go. Let's go. Who wants a mile today? Who wants a mile today? Three, two, one. 25 seconds. Good. Shaky, shaky eggs and bakey, baby. Let's go. Let's get it. You want a mile, Willie? You want a mile, Willie? I'm just going to pull your daggum shoe off your foot. Let's go. Hold that crunch, guys. Driving down. Your arms should be shaking. You got about 10 freaking seconds to go. Good. Just hit your last three, two, and one. Excellent job, guys. Crossbody, Mountain Connors of the Pops. Remember, the bicycles are okay. All right? They're more than okay. In fact, they're encouraged if you're not able to hold that kind of pressure on a shoulder right now. Three, two, and one. Shoot it. That's all it is, guys. It's a fast movement to an ISO hold. Fast movement to an ISO hold on those abs and those obliques, okay? Make sure you're really turning those hips, okay? That side of your hip should almost be pointing towards the ground as that knee rotates over towards the opposite elbow, okay? Guys, again, the bicycles work. Slowing the movement down works, but you stay in motion always. Three, two, one, rest break time. Excellent job. Woo! We got some windshield flutters. Side to side, palms stay on the ground. Three, two, one, let's go. Come on, come on. Good, guys. I need you hanging onto that ground for dear life, okay? Get yourself in that mindset. Look, it's Washboard Wednesday, okay? So if you participated in Taco Tuesday last night, should have been no different, because we all know dang well you ain't getting through that taco buffet line without hitting the John later with both hands on the side of the wall hanging on for dear life. Three, two, one. Look at that. See how fast those sets go by? Come on, enjoy the grind today. We got corkscrews. And you're already done with another round. Another one bites the dust. Ready? Get set. Let's go. Come on. Push it up and twist at the top. Push it up and twist at the top. Mm Pow! Good job. All the way up. Yes, guys. I love it. I love it. Hard work. Yup! Oh, Ethics all the way until Finishville. Yup! And you know all day long we're going to activate beast mode. All day long. Ain't no other way to operate. Three, two, and one. Hop off. Get water. See ya! for your next round, okay? What was that, three? Three down, three to go. One, two, and then three. And then you're done. 15 seconds, slow it down. Welcome to Swag City, y'all. I'm your mayor, and we're starting in five seconds. I am the mayor of Swag City. Three, two, and one. Obliques, let's engage them, guys. Thread the needle, thread the needle. Come on, you gotta be clutch today. Let's go, go ahead. that's fine. That's, somebody's gotta be the mayor or something. Go, twisty, twisty, through the bottom, okay? Now look, as you start to get into these last couple rounds, start finding ways to advance a little bit, okay? Start finding ways to push yourself a little bit more. Don't just be willing to go through the motions, all right? Three, two, and one, reverse. Burpees, okay? Now you're not gonna do it. But y'all know, grab that gear shift and throw it in reverse. Three, two, one, let's work. Man, what you doing? What you doing? We throwing it in reverse, all the way up to the top. Good job. If you started off with the one legs, you gotta go to the two legs. That's more than okay. But do not settle for a lower rate. You are worth more than that, dadgum. It's seven seconds to go. Five final seconds remaining in your set, and look at that, it's over. Good job, relax, relax. All right, we got some tabletop crunches, okay? Driving those hands through those elbows, okay? Awesome. Cardio care, man, he can't wait to do that mile. Three, two, one, let's go. Let's go, man. Oh, guys, you don't know us, man. This is, this is DJ Cam Slam, AKA Cardio Cam, and you are running a mile today, dog. Good, can't be broken, can't be broken, good. Bend but we do not break. Come on, come on. Good, seven seconds left. Awesome, I'm only gonna pull on Courtney's feet three times because she kind of scares me. And then three, two, one, we take a rest break. Good job, guys. All right, we got a crossbody mountain climber with a pause, okay? Don't forget the pause. Fast movement to a slow movement, high plank position, ready, set, go. Come on, come on, good, shoot. Every time you finish that one to three second hold, you are firing up with that other leg nice and quick. Quick contraction. 
and then slow ISO hold for one to three seconds, okay? Y'all got 10 seconds left here. Come on. I don't want to hear y'all home talking about shoulders burning. Don't want to hear you home talking about abs being fatigued. And we sure as hell ain't going to talk about being that T word. Three, two, and one. Relax. Windshield flutters. Let's go. Let's go. On your mark, get set, be small time. Come on, come on. Good. Keep those hands down on the floor. Keep those hands down on the floor, guys. Look, here's the best thing about pushing through pain, okay? Stop thinking about that pain as just a bad situation, man. I got, I got dealt a bad hand. Start thinking about that pain as a privilege, man. It's a privilege that I can get up and get after it. It's a privilege that I can work on building that six pack. It's a privilege that y'all are done in three, two, one. Good job, relax. One more set. We got corkscrews, and then you're on your final two rounds of exercise. Three, two, one, let's go. Come on, only way we know how. Only way we know how. Legs go down. If you want to add the leg lift in at the bottom here, okay, we get that nice long lever, engage the bottom of those abdominals, and then push up right like that with a twist of the heel at the top. 10 seconds to go here. Good, fight through. Fight through, last five, last three, last rep, rest break time. Good job, guys. Got about 28 seconds here. Hop off, get a sip of water, okay? If you want to bring your water out to you, where you're currently stationed at, nothing wrong with it, okay? But slow that breathing down, okay? Again, if you want to go through the rest break, okay? You want to get a little active rest. Bicycles, toe touches, V-ups. You can sprint around your house and get back into the room, and then 10 seconds, and we're going. Here it is. And five, thread the needle on that oppo elbow. Three, two, and one. Yeet! Get him. Get him. Reaching through every single time here. Guys, good. Since it's the last two rounds on this side, let's pick up that top leg if we can, which we all can today. There we go. Good. Now, we've got a good amount of core stability in there. Let's go, let's go. Just hit five. Just hit three, holding it up, holding it up, holding it up. You're not holding it up, you're done. Yeah, relax, okay? Hey, we got a reverse burpee on your booty. If you wanna start standing up, cool. If you wanna do regular burpees, swag. Let's get them, three, two, and one. Roll forward, jump up to the top. You cannot be denied if you have a relentless pursuit of excellence every freaking day. We got about 10 seconds remaining here. Yes, roll forward, get the jump at the top too. Don't neglect that top little last bit of effort. Five left, three left, keep going and relax at home. Awesome job, tabletop crunch, driving. Those hands through. Who wants it? Three, two, one, let's go. Good, awesome job. Make sure we're driving the hands through. Guys, I need those shoulder blades up off the ground the entire time here. Good, last 15 seconds of beast mode left. And we'll get him, and we'll get him. Just drag his freaking lifeless corpse across the floor. Five seconds, three seconds, hold on, hold on and relax. Good job, guys. Good. Work ethic is high here. I hope it's the same level at home. We got cross body mountain climbers or bicycles. Three, two, and one. Put in the work. Come on, come on. Good. Sweat equity has got to mean something to you today, okay? Effort has got to be between you and you today, and it's got to be at a high level of efficiency. Shoot and hold every single rep. You're down to your last five seconds. Your last three, two, and one rep. Good job, relax. Windshield flutters, side to side, and then bring those feet right down the middle, okay? The whole time, let's go, let's go. Three, two, and one, find a way, find a way. Guys, look, some of us, we lost a lot during this quarantine, okay? Some of us, maybe we lost an hour or two. I lost fabric on my shorts, okay? But that doesn't mean that you should have lost sight of your goals, daggum it. Keep them in the forefront of your mind, maintain that tunnel vision, and consistently and daily put in the work. You're down to three, two, one. We got corkscrews. And guys, these shorts are brand new. Not really, they're Tim's hand-me-downs. But here we go again. Three, two, one, last set here. Come on, go push those legs up. Back when you're, what, seven? All right, guys, 
15 seconds left here. Good, drive that up, guys. Notice, every time Courtney comes down, guys, she's not flopping, she controls that move on the way down. Make sure you're doing the exact same thing. We go up, we control the movement. We don't flop to the bottom. Let those abs control those feet on the way down. Last five, three, one, rest break time. We got one more round. One more round, and then you're, you're, <clears throat> Well, let's rip this Hello Kitty Band-Aid off. Then you're still not done. There's a finisher, okay? So there's that. 15 seconds, though. We're gonna go through these six exercises, get a little finisher at the end, uh, and then you're done. We'll part ways. You'll have a great day, and you'll be one ab closer to that six pack you dreamed of, okay? We're starting in five on that opposite elbow. Three, two, and one. Thread the needle, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. Awesome job. Notice every single time, two of the most emphasized portions of the movement is when they open that hand up to the top to get the big stretch, opening up the core, and then they rotate that hand down and dip that top shoulder to get that twist, engage a little bit more of that oblique. You got your final five, your final three, two, one. Ladies and gentlemen, excellent job. Okay, remember, this is the last of every exercise, so let's max out here. We got reverse burpees. Standing up, sitting down, either one, forward burpee, backward burpee, three, two, one. Let's go get it here. Let's go get it here, guys. Here's the, this is the way you have to think about it, okay? It's not that I'm fatigued. It's not that I'm through five rounds. It's that I've got one round left. If I have gas in the tank, I've got to expend it here and now, okay? I'm going to leave this workout with results or regrets. There won't be a gray area. You got under 10. You got under your final five seconds to go. We fight through the finish. And three, two, one, you're done. Tabletop crunch. Hold it so you don't have to hold it anymore. On your mark, get set, let's go. Good. Fire it up there, come on. Do not let those knees become separated from your hands. Good, awesome, awesome job, guys. Good, it's like a long distance relationship, man. Somebody might try to break it up, but the sturdy ones, they last, okay? You got seven seconds to go. You got five seconds to go! I thought I got him, thought I had him. And three, two, one. Relax, good job. All right, we got crossbody. Mountain climbers. We're in it. We're in it to win it. Bang! Let's go. Come on. Woo! Right on B. Get you some. Get you some. Floating that knee across, guys. Now, another thing to notice with these mountain climbers, especially as we fatigue, those shoulders start to tire out. You'll notice sometimes people start to push their hands out in front of them. All our trainers here, we're going to keep those hands right in line with our chest so that the tension stays over our chest, into our abdominals, and not on to that shoulder. Three, two, one. Rest and relax. You have windshield flutters. You have a daggum corkscrew. And then you are still not done. But you're doing good. Three, two, one, let's go. Good, hands holding the side of the ground for dear life, please. 15 seconds left in this set. As they rotate those kicks, keep those kicks nice and tiny. Those legs stay nice and straight. Guys, the lower you can get those feet, the more we're gonna pull on those bottom two evasive abdominals. You have three, two, one, and that is your last rest break until the last set which is a corkscrew. Let's get twisty. Three, two, and one. Come on, come on, whatever it takes today, guys. It's always gotta be, here's my goals, here's all the bull crap in between, and my mentality is by any means necessary, I get to point B. Let's go, let's go. 10 seconds remaining. Twist through the top for the love of the gains. Guys, you're down to your final five. Your final three, two, and one. It couldn't have been more excellent, guys. But wait, for a limited time only, there's a finisher, okay? So here's the deal. We're just gonna hold a plank, all right? So you'll be in that low plank position, okay? I want you guys to accept the challenge. As of right now, nothing allows that knee to go to the ground, okay? Nothing. I don't care if you have to transition into a high plank and then go right back into the low plank. You only get three seconds in that high plank before you reset, okay? Nothing puts that knee down. Good news is, it's not that long. So when I count to three, we're gonna start your plank finisher. Ready? Three. Three, there we go, good. Hold that plank, good. Now that you're in the plank, I can tell you, it's not that long, guys. It's okay. You'll be fine, we'll find a way. 
All right, guys, you've only got like, uh, what, 30 seconds left, right? No, we got a little bit longer than that, okay? Now, as you start to feel that pain creep in, you have to start to remember, man, who am I going to be at the end of this workout? Who am I going to be when I whisk off my shirt? Guys, that's all abs are, okay? We do core. Not to maintain a strong center of body, but to maintain the possibility to be able to tear your shirts off your body at any second and have some daggum heads turn, okay? In reality, you're about a minute into your plank and you only have about a minute left, okay? In fact, in about 10 seconds, we're into it and exactly 60 seconds left in that plank here. Come on, come on. You can't be denied when you set your mind to the goal and let nothing phase you, okay? Are your shoulders burning? Yeah, maybe. Are the abs burning? Hopefully so, okay? But when you're wrapped in your Princess Elsa towel, front and center on the beach, nobody's gonna say anything when you got six tater tots poking out from under her cute little crown. You got about 30 seconds left in this set. Here we go. Here we go. Good job. Come on. Come on. Abs are made in the kitchen, but they are daily freaking prepared by your level of hard work. Let's go. Good. You got about 15 seconds left in it now. Fight. Fight. When it starts to burn. When it starts to burn. If you want to just keep holding it home, you keep holding it. But you're down to your final five, four, four, four and done guys great job relax okay awesome effort at home guys hopefully you were able to get through the whole thing hopefully you're able to hold the plank the whole time guys here's the deal if you weren't able to hold the plank the whole time you put that knee down okay let's set that goal the next time we do another plank finisher that we can hold that the entire time okay excellent job everyone here okay we wish you the best we hope everyone watching has a very blessed day okay guys uh feel free to like and subscribe to these videos if you want to become part of the swole patrol okay just like the only way we know how we're gonna break it down on two quick claps and a family on three ready one two three family